Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and to another episode of Keeping Up with Star Rail. It's Blade's turn and I'm very excited to check him and his abilities out. I already tried him in the game, but I didn't get him because my pity is like 25 now or something like that or 35. And I have been running out of gems, so <laughs> I need to farm gems a little bit more to like get him. Um, but yeah, I'm very interested in this episode of Keeping Up With Star Rail. I'm very interested as well who is introducing him besides Albert. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave a like on the video. Also check out my socials, they are somewhere up there. And yeah, if you haven't seen my trailer reaction to version 1.2 and also to Blade himself and to his trailer, you can check that out, check them out. I will link both videos in the description box below. So make sure to check these out as well. And I would say we will start right away. Let's go. Sometimes the fiercest currents are hidden beneath the calmest waters. <laughs> okay. Every today's featured star, nothing could be closer to the truth he's a man who's passed through Ooh. fire and back wait sorry for pausing but isn't the leaf a resemblance for danha again his soul concealed beneath a stone cold gaze today we're exploring the secrets mm -hmm. of the notorious stellaron hunter and wanted criminal Kafka and blade. blade let's go blade and we're out of time already he is a really interesting character and he has like really interesting abilities see you the next one folks hello hmm? albert miss kafka please i i didn't mean okay. to offend the celeron hunters <laughs> listen to me continue with the program a uh, great idea miss kafka <laughs> Blade is a wind-type character following the path of destruction. He wields a fragmented sword that cuts through all obstacles in his way. His basic attack, Shard Sword, deals wind damage to a single target. Consume a skill point and a set amount of HP to use Blade's oh, skill that's a nice and initiate Elf which increases damage dealt for a set number of turns. Using this skill does not regenerate energy and won't end the turn. While Hellscape is active, Blade's basic attack is enhanced to Forest of Swords. Forest of Swords consumes a set amount of HP and deals wind damage to an enemy and adjacent targets based on Blade's attack and max HP. Blade's skill cannot be retriggered he while looks Hellscape really is cool. active. And using his skill or enhanced basic attack when his HP is too low will reduce it to one. Okay. His combat is easy on the eye, but it comes at a cost. In the form of work-related injuries? <laughs> exactly. Mm -hmm. Luckily, Blady doesn't need to sue. <laughs> Lady. <laughs> when Blade loses HP, he gains a charge which lasts for a set number of turns. When charges are fully stacked, Blade unleashes a follow-up attack on all enemies and recovers a set Ooh. amount of HP. The damage dealt is based on his attack and max HP. All charges are consumed after unleashing the follow-up attack. That is actually power comes really with a nice. Price, but that mm. price can become power in turn. And during exploration, use True. Blade's technique Karma Wind to instantly attack an enemy. After entering battle, some of Blade's HP is consumed and he deals mm. wind damage based on a set percentage of its max HP to all enemies. Enemies. When Blade this is something his, I tried. Ultimate, his inner turmoil death is sentence. released as his sword lays bare the line between life and death. His current HP is set to 50% of his max HP. I'm sorry, but Honkai Star Wars animation are actually super, super pretty and cool and fancy. And he I really enjoy damage them. damage to a single target as well as damaging a... And he's a pretty man. I mean, his eyes are a little bit creepy. But he's very handsome. Handsome? I don't know. He's like pretty. An immortal's beauty. He's a beauty. Okay. Man can be beauties as well. Jason enemies. Damage dealt is based on Blade's attack, max HP, and the cumulative lost HP he sustained during the battle. Remember that this cumulative HP loss has a limit. And the count is reset after every use of his ultimate. Blade okay. may never witness the paradise on the opposite shore, but he's generous when it comes to sending others. Mm -hmm. 
Blade consumes his own HP, casts his skill to initiate Hellscape, consumes his HP a second time, and sweeps the enemy away with his forest of swords. And the greater true, the true. enemy resistance, the more charges Blade accumulates. All attacks that fail to defeat Blade only make him stronger. When charges are fully stacked, Blade brandishes his sword and launches a follow-up attack against all enemies, restoring a set amount of HP in the process. He then uses... Conquest Star Rail really is a game where the character design is really appealing to me. Like from nearly every character. I mean, there are characters that are not that interesting but character design wise i think every character up until now has like very good you know clothing colors and everything like that i really enjoy it i think every character is pretty this is ultimate reducing his hp to 50 percent of his max hp and sending all enemies to the opposite shore <laughs> a non-refundable all-inclusive one-way ticket to paradise miss kafka were you satisfied with today's program? Mm. Very. Although it did kind of sound like someone had a gun to your head. <laughs> no. <laughs> really? <laughs> Everything I said was straight from the heart. Mm. Including the warm welcome you gave me? Straight from the heart? Mm. I'm glad to hear it. So you're interested in paradise? The opposite shore. Perhaps I can arrange for Blade to... Uh, <laughs> 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 second thought, uh, I fancy a staycation this year. <laughs> okay, that was it. Uh, the four minutes went by so fast. But it's, it was very interesting because he's the first character in Honka Star Rail Ride that works with like HP consummations. He's a little bit like Hu Tao, right? Dropping his HP so he can make more damage. Very interesting. I really like that. But yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Not, not much to say actually about him during the video. Um, everything is like very clear how he works. That's really it for my reaction right now. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.